Hi, I am Revati. I am working as assistant professor in SNS College of Engineering. Today we will discuss the topic about point to point protocol. The triple P stands for point to point protocol. It is the most commonly used protocol for point to point access. Suppose the user wants to access the internet from the home the triple p protocol will be used it is a data link layer protocol that resides in the layer 2 of the osi model it is used to encapsulate the layer 3 protocols and all the information available in the payload in order to be transmitted across the serial links the triple p protocol can be used on synchronous link like isdn as well as asynchronous link like dial-up. It is mainly used for the communication between two devices. It can be used over many types of physical networks such as serial cable, phone line, trunk line, cellular telephone, fiber optic link such as Sonet as the data link layer protocol is used to identify from where the transmission starts and ends. So, ISP use the triple P protocol to provide the dial-up access to the internet. Services provided by triple P. It defines the format of frames through which the transmission occurs. It defines the link establishment process. If user establishes a link with the server, then how this link establishes is done by the triple P protocol. It defines data exchange process. How data will be exchanged, the rate of the exchange. The main feature of the triple P protocol is the encapsulation. It defines how network layer data and information in the payload are encapsulated in the data link frame. It defines the authentication process between the two devices, the authentication between two devices, handshaking and how the password will be exchanged between two devices are decided by the triple P protocol. It is a byte oriented protocol. It provides the frames as a collection of bytes or characters. It is a WAN protocol as it runs over the internet link which means between two uh, routers internet is widely used. It is a byte oriented protocol as it provides the frames as a collection of bytes or characters. It is a WAN protocol as it runs over the internet link which means between two routers internet is widely used. Triple P has two main uses which are given below. It is widely used in broadband communications having heavy loads and high speed. For example, an internet operates on heavy load and high speed. It is used to transmit the multi-protocol data between the two connected point point-to-point compute, point computers. It is mainly used in point-to-point -point devices. For example, routers or point-to-point -point devices where triple P protocol is widely used as it is a WAN protocol, not a simple LAN Ethernet protocol. Frame format of triple P protocol. Flag. The flag field is used to indicate the start and end of the frame. The flag field is a one byte field that appears at the beginning and ending of the frame. The pattern of the flag is similar to the bit pattern in HDLC. Address. It is a one byte field that contains the constant value which is 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 8 ones. These 8 ones represent a broadcast message.
control it is a one byte field which is set through the constant value 